Hi guys, um, well, I tell you what, ever since Changes Common has, um, um, plugged me on our channel, uh, man, uh, I'm not kidding, the amount of, like, God interacting with me and telling me to make videos and stuff has been triple fold man you know um and uh and he's uh uh telling me so clearly now <clears throat> well okay i got a little secret i gotta share with you guys okay so i got a picture of jesus christ's portrait you know the akiana picture the painting it's on top of my TV in the living room, and for a very long time, well, uh, at least two and a half months. I'm not. I'm not joking, guys. Like uh, I'm talking to, I'm talking to an angel, at least one, um, and. And the Holy Spirit inside my chest, my stomach, my tummy. <laughs> and, uh, um, and I'll verify. I'll look. I'll look at the at the portrait of of Jesus Christ, and it confirms. It's uh, his eyes open. He smiles. And then I'll tell my wife, like, babe, babe, the portrait's moving again. It's smiling. It's smiling. And Jesus is like, I'm not in the portrait. I'm here, right? I'm here. And then uh, I, I'm, I get like, whoa. And I start bowing. I start getting on the ground, man. To, you know? And I've been doing that for a few months now. And it's been going on a while. So that's what's up over here, and yeah, um, so God is like, um, uh, he's like, I want you to like hurry up and make a video and tell them that there's like no time left, man, there's no time left, they've used up, he's used up all the extra allotted time, the time and half a time and half a time or whatever, and um, and uh and the three days of darkness is right around the corner um i've asked him about the rapture and There's like no rapture, dudes. Um, there is something like a rapture for like some people, but it's so few. It's not what you think, you know. And he told me earlier, okay, like I was in my living room and suddenly he jumps into me. Or, or the awareness, like, hello, Eric, I need you to pay attention. And he says, the rapture is demonic teaching, right? Who am I to, look, guys, I'm no Bible scholar. I have no vested interest in this thing. I haven't spent the last 10 years arguing to, for, or against, okay? I'm just telling you exactly what the Spirit told me, and I'm telling you what the Spirit is telling me to say, so... Easy on the comments, man. You know, I, I'm not very, I'm not very good at uh, confrontation. You know, um, so yeah, okay. So that's the dealio, and uh, and I don't know what to make of it because I'm just happy I'm one four four K sealed, and I don't know the deal. Okay, like my last few years have been so jarringly tough, and I guess they haven't been so difficult in terms of physical pain. So hallelujah, thank you God for for that, but. Uh, yeah, uh, doesn't look like, okay, um, 
pray upon that. Um, and you know what? I don't feel like the scripture is conclusive by any by any means on that subject. You really have to do backflips to see, like you have to do logic backflips to conclude that there is that. I, I'm sorry, it's not very clear to me at all. For me, it's clear that who, those who died for him in his name in the tribulation, it's clear they're the ones that get so-called raptured, taken into the sky after they're dead, right? Everyone, like, that's the, that's the rough news, man. It's, it, this is going to make World War II Holocaust look like nothing, you know? This is going to be a whack time. Uh, I'm sorry for that, and, you know, like, it's not a very feel-good message, but uh, there's a reason why um, this is amping up, and there's a reason why, like, people have yeah some people have been for a long time like sean has been blessed and for for years but okay so holy spirit wind you know that guy uh i've been re recommending his channel for a while everything he says literally came true and god's like pay attention to this guy and you know what one of them was he's like a few months ago he's like uh there's like more like demons going to come around and like they're just going to be all over the place right and some of them will be outside of your house at night. And he's like, keep the curtains closed. Don't look outside, blah, blah, blah. And and I noticed that. I moved into this new place and we didn't have curtains. And I was like, oh, crap, you know, like, well, I just watched this video. We don't have curtains. What are we going to do? And of course, we got curtains on time, luckily. And, um, and a few months ago, I noticed that there's like more demons outside of uh, like outside of our house at in the middle of the night. And they get into your brain when you're sleeping. And then I'm like, yo, it's another one of those demons, right? And I wake up and then I hear right outside of my apartment. No, it's not. No, not sorry, not the apartment. My apartment was in the other city. And it's not some kind of weird owl in the forest or nothing like that. And I hear, you know, I've heard cats mating at night. It's not cats. It's not an animal. Okay. Uh, and plus the same thing happened when I was over at the big, in the big city um visit my parents um between earlier uh this month um my little niece was having a, a birthday and my mom's got anyways we were over there for like two weeks same thing happened there uh demons were walking outside in the backyard i know this sounds really strange but it's for reals and and i heard them and I was like, uh-oh, and I felt the presence, and then I hear them rah, 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 saying weird things. No, it's, okay, so even the way I'm imitating the sounds that they make doesn't actually sound like them. I can't, they sound like cartoons. They sound like little cartoon demons. They literally sound like uh, demons in cartoons. So anyways, Holy Spirit wins talking about this, but he didn't just say that there's going to be like demons and whatnot. He said, hey, three days of darkness is right around the corner really really right around the corner and to some people you better start prepping you better start buying like some pasta or something uh, keep it in your house pray to god ask him and it i you know i thought a lot of christians had this ability to commune with god i thought it was pretty pretty normal like you could hear him in here like you know when you that's in the bible says he is the one that's inside you he's and you know, when I had my conversion, you know, Jesus says, I will prick your heart. I felt a prick in my heart, like twice, as a matter of fact. You know, like I thought that was standard territory for most people that are born again, right? But then again, I did notice that if you don't seek God, if you don't keep a good path, if you're watching online porn and stuff like that, that dies quickly, okay? So like, I think that's what's up. And maybe I'm raving and ranting and I'm really sorry about that. But anyways, that's the deal. And God was like, make the video, tell him. And I want you to tell him like pretty straight up and watch Holy Spirit Wind, his YouTube, because this here is like a total waste of time. Just go watch Holy Spirit Wind. All right, guys, I love you. If I've made you feel bad, don't worry. <laughs> All right, guys. Peace and love. Pray God. It's all good, man. It's all good. If you've ever wanted to see the biggest fireworks show of all eternity, it's happening now. Hallelujah still. Hallelujah still. Amen. Peace and love, guys. Love Jesus. Love God. Amen.